Art is popping up in Eugene in what some may call unusual places. Now, this is a project by the City of Eugene's Public Art Committee. KZI 9 News anchor Sean Cuellar shows us Art the Box. Traffic lights, signs, and cars. It's what you expect to see in downtown Eugene. In fact, you see it so much, you almost don't pay attention. So when out of nowhere bright colors appear, you notice. A new art installation is turning heads and getting people talking. <laughs> All right. These steel traffic control boxes now artwork. In June, the city of Eugene sent out a call to artists. Four of them were selected for the Art the Box project, including Brian Putnam, a University of Oregon Masters of Fine Art candidate. I got approved for five, so I'll be doing five of these right around um, this downtown area between Willamette and Oak and 6th to Broadway. His art is bright, bold, colorful, and fluid. My work is really revolves around this kind of ongoing Northwest epic that I've been working on, utilizing a lot of different characters. We caught up with him at 6th and Oak, an artist at work on a very busy street corner, many wondering what he's doing. I have had several people ask me if what I'm doing is legal or not, and I've re reassured them that yes, this is a city project. It's sponsored by the City of Eugene's Public Art Committee. The goal? Create compelling 2D work on select traffic boxes, 10 in total. Each artist is assigned to an area reflecting the personality of that corner. Some of the artwork is bold, others more abstract. But Brian has noticed, though, it's all appreciated. People have been just unbelievably positive about it. Like, uh, people have just been saying that they love it, that they're so excited to see downtown brightened up like this. The art will be up for at least two years, which will require maintenance. Brian's okay with that. It's his artwork on display, and that's an honor. In Eugene, Sean Cuellar, KEZI 9 News.